Hello, hello to my Zook fam. I'm back with another workout for you guys. Back to your core, okay? So this time, I have a 10 in 10. Literally 10 exercises in 10 minutes. One minute work per exercise, focusing on your core, okay? We're gonna do a cardio core circuit. So it's a core-based circuit, but a little bit of cardio elements in it, but everything is to do with your core, okay? I've also organized it so that your first exercise will start in a plank position, all right? So facing down on the mat, and your second exercise, you'll be going on your back, and you'll keep going alternating like that, front, back, front, back, okay? So, I will actually just go through it as we go along, so I'm not gonna like give you a demo all that. We're just gonna get right to it, quick 10 minute workout, quick burn, and we are done. So again, beats courtesy of Zoo Live, yeah. Okay, so I'm gonna get the timer on. So the first exercise, we have our mountain climbers, okay? So remember, it's just one minute uh, work. Essentially, it's about 50 seconds, I mean, one minute, well, 50 seconds work, because I'll have like about 10 seconds to explain the next exercise to you, okay? But let's try to get right into the next exercise as soon as we can, okay? So, let's get on your mats. I'm just gonna get right to it. Not much of a warm up needed because we're going to do basic core stuff. Mountain climbers will be a warm up anyway, okay? All right, are you ready guys? We blast that music. <laughs> all right, ready. So, all you need, okay, sorry, before we start. Sorry, sorry, we're gonna mention guys. Uh, besides your mat, we do need your water bottle as usual and your towel to wipe your sweat or to line your mat. But why we also need a fully filled water bottle is we're actually using it as a prop and a, and a weight today, okay? So have your bottle ready and make sure it doesn't leak. Alright, so on your mats, have your bottle ready next to your mat. Alright, let's go guys. Rock and roll. In three, two, one. Mountain climbers, let's stop that plank. Use your bottle as a prop and get a good jackknife. So legs straight, arms straight, above your head. 
Cross climbers. Woo! All right. In your plank position. You like mountain climbers, but instead of going straight, you're gonna criss cross. All right. Bring your knee to your opposite elbow. Let's go. Core tight. Long low. Again, obliques. One more for this and we're done for the day. 20 seconds. Keep working. Last 15. Last 10. 8. 7. 6. 5. 4. Last one. 3, 2, 1. Into your hollow rock. Arms are used. Make your body like a banana. Imagine you are a steel ball on a table, I'm tipping, and you're tipping, so rock. Your arms don't leave your ears. Don't swing up with your arms. Don't use momentum, keep this tight. Your biceps, your elbow next to your ears. Let's go. Come on, almost there. I know it hurts. I know it burns. Push through this pain, and you're gonna come out of it stronger and better. In seconds. Let's go. Six, five, four, three, two. Woo! One. And we are done for today. Yes. Oh my God. I am super sweaty, definitely got the cardio weight in, and oh my goodness, my abs are on fire. Yours should be too. Let's do an ab check. See that? Look how pumped they are. Super pumped, pumped, happy with that. Yes, I hope you guys feel it. Really, really hurts, honestly, it really, really hurts right now, but it's good, right? Pain is good. No pain, no gain, guys. Pain is good when it comes to exercise. Well, it depends. Not injury pain, but muscle pain, it's always a good sign, okay? If it doesn't hurt, somehow I feel like you didn't push hard enough, okay? So I always tell my clients, the reps that hurt the most are the ones that count, are the ones that count okay? So very quick stretch. I know I sound sadistic, right? <laughs> All right, quick stretch, guys. On your mats, just into your up dog. Ooh. Down. Now push your chest off the floor into your up dog. Soft elbows. Shoulders down away from your ears. So when I say soft elbows, I mean don't lock them like this. Keep them soft and slightly bent. And when I say shoulders down away from your ears, I mean don't drop and shrug like this. Push the floor away from you. That's it. Look up slightly. Close your mouth. Just breathe. Feel the stretch in your core and your abs. All right, let's go into a child pose. Stretch out the back. So this time, sit back from there. Just shift your way back into a child pose. Just relax. Bum on your heel. Just relax. Breathe. Pour it on the ground. All right, we can come to one more up dog. Again. And now again to your downward dog. All right, and just for your obliques, you just come up. All right, all right. You're just gonna cross one leg in front, push up to the side, and reach over far on the other side. Feel the stretch, hip flexors, obliques, and lats even on the side of your body. Hold it there, and the other side. Super, extremely, super guys.
thank you so much for joining me. 10 minutes was all you needed, besides all my yapping. <laughs> um, well done, and I will see you guys very, very soon in the next workout. Thanks for joining. Bye-bye.